Hey lug nuts, it's me Meredith. I wanted to show you this new bag I got today. It is the lug box car. Very similar to the Ranger in size and I'll do a video comparison soon of them together. But I wanted to show you this bag on its own. One of the big things that makes this bag different is that these gray trim lines, and you can see it in the video that they kind of are reflective. Like they, this whole, the whole thing has this reflective kind of mist to it. So even when it's, you can see the rest of the bag goes dark and these still keep reflecting that light, um, light on it. So it's even got kind of like, um, yeah, you can just tell that it's very, it's really reflective in those lines. It has the arrows quilting, which I like a lot. This color, by the way, is the Heather Gray. One of my favorite colors. It's flanked by the gray reflective, and then it has the gunmetal gray zipper pulls. So um, I haven't even gone through this bag fully on my own because my girls have been all about my <laughs> new bag. So I've yanked it away from them, came to my bedroom to quick look it over and get you guys a quick review. So you've got two zipper pockets on the front. The bottom one goes all the way to the bottom of the bag. Uh, and I don't feel an RFID tag in there. The next one is that fleece line and it only goes about to the middle. Here's where my finger lands. So you're, it's perfect for your phone. It won't go too deep. Um, won't, so that it's not, you don't have to go fishing too far for it. It does zip close. So if you don't like their signature phone pocket with the magnetic closure, this is a handy zipper, um, spot for your phone. On the side, we've got that water bottle pocket, which when you're not using, you fold away, but it snaps open. And it even has a little a Velcro to kind of keep it in place. So uh, it's easy to just kind of fold it closed, snap up the sides, and it tucks away for you there. Uh, so I love having a water bottle holder on my bags it's just helps me keep thinking about drinking water, which is, you know, very important. Um, the other side has nothing. So it is a lopsided bag where if you brought a bottle on one side, the other bag, the other side has nothing. By the way, the bottom, no feet, no wipeable, um, plastic coating or anything. This is just a regular fabric. The back side does have that reflective piece all over. And then the back pocket here, has two pen hold, pen slots. And let me feel this one to see if there's an RFID tag. I don't see one in here either. So maybe it's, yeah, it's there. It says here that there's an RFID pocket. So we'll see if I can figure out which one it is or we might have to go back to their website to find out. Uh, the back side also has these little belt loops. So you can take the strap, feed it through here and then wear it as a belt bag. It's a pretty big belt bag for me. I would much rather wear something with a much smaller profile for a belt bag. This really is going to be much more of a crossbody bag for me. The boxcar does have a little grab handle on the top, just very similar to the Ranger and the Scoop, which is excellent. I like having the handle there to grab it when I'm out. There's the crossbody strap, which has you can remove. You can use it as that belt bag very easy. Okay, the inside, you've got a bungee key clip for your keys. On the back side is a clear view pocket. I like that it's on the back side and not on the front. It does go all the way to the bottom because if it's on the front, sometimes these pockets are full, that pocket's full and it's hard to get my phone in and out. So I like that it's on the back. The front, you've got two cargo pockets here and still a privacy zip pocket. So I use my privacy zip pocket for more feminine things. So, um, so it's handy to have that on the front because they're a little bit flatter than the stuff I put in the clear view pocket. So um, it's the box car, the box car bag by Lug. If you like my videos, please click like and subscribe. And I'd love to hear from you. Comment down below. Thanks.